partial attention. (laughs) You want to make sure that the chapters are really short. But I also found like there's a lot of stories in the book, right? Yeah. And what I found when I've gone to these different QBRs as a as a consultant or board member, when I get asked to or invited to come in, maybe at the last one I might have told a story. And let's call it the gray boy story, which is in the book. And then I come back and there's new people in the room. And you might ask me, hey John, tell the gray boy story again. And so what I started to realize is people really love stories and they love the analogy or the parallel between the story and the concept that it brought them and what they need to do in real life or real sales situations instead of what they're doing. So it's a way in which they're putting a tag in their mind saying, this is, I know what to do because of the gray boy story or the peas and carrots, you know, all the different stories that I put in the book. And you don't want the stories to be long. You want them to be short. And one of the fundamentals in the book is that sales leaders need to, and sales reps need to keep things simple, not complex. Our job as sales leaders and sales reps is to make things simple, not more complex. So as an example, a lot of times you'll see somebody put up PowerPoint slides and it's, I usually, I stop them a lot of times. I'll like, wait a second. It's called PowerPoint, not power story and not power book right? If you only have two or three points to get across to your audience, then that's all you should get across. You shouldn't make it more complex with more words and pictures and all kinds of things on your slides. Break it down so that if your grandmother can't understand it, then you can't explain it, right? And even a lot of the way I would try to get around that when I was a sales leader is I made sure that everybody could do what I call the whiteboard pitch. Forget about the PowerPoint slides. Forget about the blah, blah, blah presentation that you think you're going to do because you're really a fast talker. What I want you to do is take this marker, go up to the whiteboard and whiteboard. Tell me a story. Whiteboard a story about our product and the benefits it has for customers. And customers love that too because you're painting the picture right in front of them as you draw on the board. So it's... It's really, again, it's about the simplicity of things and not making things really more complex.